Um, and I think that's a really important um, for any kind of hardship you're going through. That's a really important mindset to have is everything brings opportunities, even disaster. Um, and when we can be looking for the opportunities rather than just what's taken from us or what's restricted, I think that's when I see really, um, I think, incredible growth and immense creativity. Um, that's actually one of the things that I'm, um, I'm really encouraged by, just as I see in my neighborhood, like our neighborhood Facebook page, um, all of the creative ways that people are coming up with to be there for each other um, and to keep our sense of community. Um, it's kind of mind blowing. You know, in the past it was, we have a block party every summer and that's about all we could think of to help each other out and come together. And now it's like, th there's so much going on and it's so creative and so connecting and it really comes out of, let's see what we can do. Yeah, you know, it's interesting. We, we had a, a staff meeting this morning for Seeking Integrity for the Treatment Center, and one of our uh, therapists is in Tennessee right now um, and sort of telecommuting with, with the clients. But she said in her neighborhood, there's a, a lot of kids, um, and the parents have all gotten together and because they can take their kids for a walk. But, you know, with social distancing, the kids can't really play together because of the social distancing that's in place. But um, the parents chat every morning on, and have some group chat, and they decide who's going to put bears in the windows, like stuffed yeah. bears. And like three of them do it. And the game for all the kids is to find all the bears on their walk. Yeah. And, you know, and they, they kind of communally come together to make a game for the kids even you know all to play even though they can't play together and I, you know i think that kind of stuff